Greetings, my name is Amelia Earhart. I was first because I was the first woman to fly across the Atlantic and Pacific Ocean. I was born on July 24th, 1897 in Kansas. I had a little sister named Mary Ellen, but I just called her Pidge. When I was a kid, I moved around a lot because my dad had to move with his job. No matter where I lived, I always loved roller coasters. When I was 22, my dad bought me a ride on a plane. As soon as we took off, I knew what I wanted to do. Fly. Back in the early 1900s, women pilots were uncommon. But that didn't stop me. Later, I worked as a nurse for World War plane pilots. While I worked on the injured pilots, they told me about their adventures. It made me want to fly even more. I was taught to fly by one of the few women pilots. By the time I could fly, I had enough money to buy my, my own plane. Once I was a really good pilot, I decided that I was going to set a new reputation for women to show that men are not the only ones who can do dangerous and exciting things, and that women are capable of those types of things, too. So the first chance I got, I hopped in that plane and took off across the Atlantic Ocean. In 19... 35, I was the first to fly across the Pacific Ocean. I I think I have just one last flight left in my system, I would say. In 1937, I set out to fly around the world's equator. Somewhere in Howland Island, I radioed the Navy that we were almost out of gas. No one has found me yet.